Hello, my name is Dr. Stephen Mandy, and I am a dermatologist associated with South Beach Dermatology in Miami Beach, Florida. Let's talk about remedies for a dry scalp. Dry scalp is probably one of the biggest misnomers in, in dermatology because people come in complaining of dry scalp and they think they need some sort of an oil to moisturize the scalp. Most of the time, flaking and dryness of the scalp is due to dandruff. Dandruff is caused by a, an organism, a yeast, called pterosporum. It lives in the scalp and it thrives in people who have actually an oily scalp, not a dry scalp. The reason for the flaking is that this organism causes inflammation of the skin and that inflammation causes peeling, just like a sunburn results in peeling. So it doesn't require oil or oil-based treatments to deal with the uh, flaking and peeling of the scalp. What it really requires is something that kills the yeast. The most effective things that are available over the counter are selenium sulfide shampoos like Salson Blue and Head and Shoulders. Fortunately for the average consumer, these products now come in a variety of shampoo types for bleached hair, blonde hair, uh, dry scalp, oily scalp, etc. So you can take your pick and they're cosmetically elegant enough that most people are happy with them. They must be used at least two to three times a week or more and they're safe to use every day without harming the hair. So for patients who have itchy, quote, dry scalp, you really have a mild yeast infection which will respond most effectively to using a daily or every other day anti-dandruff shampoo. If that alone is not sufficient to improve the scalp, one can add to the shampoos a tar-based shampoo such as T-Gel on an alternate day basis because the tar shampoos are very effective at reducing itching and they also kill the yeast.